What's up guys, Jason Wardrop here and in today's video I'm going to show you how to make a Facebook page for complete beginners. This is 2018 edition so I'm going to give you a complete Facebook page tutorial rundown here. Now if you go through and you're in business nowadays it's really important to have a Facebook page. One, because it's 100% free and it's really easy to go create I'm going to show you guys exactly how to do that. Two, you can run Facebook ads which if you do it the right way it can be very profitable for your business. And three, you're able to go through and reach a huge audience, a huge market where you're you might not have been able to reach otherwise. So, guys, right here we are on Facebook, right? And you guys can see I've got my my newsfeed all blocked off. But in order to go through and create a Facebook page, all we got to do is come up here to the top right hand corner, and you're going to see this dark blue drop down area. Okay, now you can see I've got actually a lot of pages right here already, so you can actually create as many pages as you want. But in order to create a new page, what you're going to do is come over here to create page and it's going to walk you through this step by step tutorial. Now, this is extremely easy. Facebook takes you, holds you by the hand basically step by step. And they first say, hey, you know, what type of Facebook page do you want to create? Are you a local business or place, a company, a brand? Are you just wanting to make a public figure one? So, like if you're trying to brand yourself, I like to go with that one. It's an entertainment page or cause or community. Now, for this example, let me just say we're gonna go through and brand brand you as the individual, right? So we're just gonna click on this public figure one. Okay, so it says choose a category. So what type of public figure do you want to be? Like, are you an entrepreneur? Are you a dancer, a comedian, author? Like, it has all these different options right here. So for this, I'm just gonna say I am an entrepreneur because that's what I am. And you come through here and say you can put in your name. All right. And so like right here, let's say you are a realtor. You're in the real estate niche. Sometimes it's nice to say like hey, I'm a Dallas realtor or Orlando or Phoenix realtor So you kind of say like where you're located and then also the profession So then somebody if like they see your post and they have no idea who you are They can get a quick idea of, of who you are and what business you're in all right So for this one, I'm just gonna say demo example I've already got my own personal Facebook page just says Jason Wardrop So I don't really want to confuse it with that. So what we're gonna do is just click get started It's gonna take us through to the next step of this whole process and guys this is so 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 easy to go through and do so it says okay add a profile picture Help people find your page by adding a photo Okay, now you can either skip it or upload a profile picture So I've already got one right here on my desktop. This is kind of just my classic profile picture We'll hit open upload one key thing on this guys What I would highly recommend is going through and if you have a profile picture that you use on other like LinkedIn or Instagram on other sources it's good to have the same profile picture across all your social media accounts because then people are able to see like okay That's that same person and this especially if you have a name like for example Jeff Johnson Where that's kind of a common name where you can see like okay That's the same person and they're not getting all confused all right now what you can do is says upload a cover photo so to add a cover photo I want to show you guys really quick how you guys can create a hundred percent free easy cover photo even if you don't have any design skills, it doesn't cost any money. So sometimes like you'll have a cool looking picture from, you know, maybe it, let's say you're a realtor of a, a listing that you have or um, maybe a cool scenery shot. But if you don't have that, what I like to use is a site called Canva. So C-A-N-V-A.com. And the cool thing is you can see right here, I have all these different pictures and stuff that I've gone through and create. So what you could do is come over here to more. And this is after you go through and log and create your account and it's like I said guys 100% free very easy to use Then we're gonna do is come down here And they have all of these pre-built sizes because like each each social media platform they have their pre-built sizes and um, You want to be able to make sure it matches up with whatever that size is so right here you have the Facebook cover Okay, now it already says it's 820 by 312 pixels which I'm assuming that's right just because it's already pre-built in here We come in here we click on that and then we're able to start with a clean slate right here. Okay, or we can come in here and say, okay, we want to go through and use this template or this one, or you know, we've got all these different templates that we can go through and use use right here. And there's a couple of them. You can see most of them say free over here. It's like for example, this one right here. This is free. But if there's ones that they cost like a dollar or something like that, it's probably because I'm trying to find they've got a ton of free ones now. Um, if it costs a dollar typically, it's just because of the image that they're using. All right, so for example Let's just come in here. Let's use no. I like that other one. Let's use that other one that I had Okay, so if we scroll up scroll actually, let's just use this one right here 
Okay, so we come in here and we could just say, hey, you know, Jason, and then maybe we'll just throw the the last name in here, make it look all cool. So we've got Jason Wardrop, and then you could put like, you know, your business or kind of like your niche that you folks are like if you're a realtor, um, a dentist, or what whatever type of business you're in, right? An entrepreneur, e-commerce store owner, whatever it is. And then you come in and you can upload pictures from Google, from your desktop, from whatever it is. And just throw it in here and so it's not this like random picture of a building okay so we can come in here like maybe we come over here throw that in there and you can make it so it's like okay it's black and white or we can change the filter let's just maybe make it normal right there and this is good for now so we can just say and guys cool thing is is you can drag and drop this all around very simple very easy to use and we'll just hit download here and then we'll come back to this part right here where it says add a cover photo and we're just gonna upload it all right, so if we come back, let's actually drag this to my desktop really quick here. And if we come back to my Facebook page, I upload a cover photo. This should be right there on my background. Okay, right here, guys. So we just hit open, and it just goes through, uploads it, and then now we have created our Facebook page. Now look at this, guys. The cool thing is Facebook walks you through hand by hand like, and shows you the next steps. Okay, okay now let's invite your friends. So now what you can do, and I'm not going to do this because this is more of a demo Facebook page, but I can go through and I can start just click invite, 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 and invite all of my friends. You can say see all friends and go through and click and invite all of your different friends. Okay, now once you're done with that, it obviously shows you, okay, here's how you go through, publish, create a post. And um, what I like to do typically is make a post, make a post about yourself. Okay, so do like a little bio. So let me just show you guys what my Facebook page looks like is I've got so this is kind of my Facebook cover photo which I showed you guys we made my profile picture and then down here I actually have a another spot where I've got a picture of myself and then I've got a little quick bio on me who I am as a person so you know hey I welcome to my Facebook page my name is Jason Wardrop and then I've got kind of like a little picture of me again okay so you can come in here throw another picture of you so let's see right there and tell a little bit about yourself hey I'm a realtor in the Dallas area Hey, I um, I run an e-commerce store. Hey, I have an Amazon. So what, whatever business you're in, and you just hit publish, and then what you can do is because kind of like a normal newsfeed, once you have other posts, it's gonna pop down to the bottom. What you can do here is just come over here to these three little buttons and just say, hey, pin to the top of the page. So kind of how I've got this up here at the very top, even though I posted it back in 2016, it's now 2018. That will still remain at the top. So kind of a cool little way to brand yourself and then you can come sit here you can see all these different things of add a short description tell a little bit about what your Facebook page is about what business you're in you can also come over here and add a button so like this is a call to action button so like saying hey do you want someone to contact you do you want them to go to your website do you want to join like a Facebook group so we can just say hey I want them to contact me and I want them to send me a Facebook message because that's kind of non-invasive right like not everyone nowadays is actually gonna pick up the phone and call you or send an email so we'll just hit that we'll say Facebook Messenger okay and then we go through and finish that and so now if they click on this it's gonna go through and send a Facebook message to this Facebook page now it's not gonna pop up right here because this is your personal profile messages but it's gonna go through and be a message to this actual Facebook page right now guys I think that's kind of a quick rundown of everything that you need to know about how to create how to make a Facebook page for your business the complete tutorial right here so if you guys do have any other questions make sure you drop a comment down below I'm more than happy to answer them but you can see how simple and easy it is to go make a Facebook page for your business here in 2018 this is the updated version of going through and setting this up for your business so if you guys have any questions drop down below also if you guys found this helpful give a thumbs up and also, if you are brand new to this channel, my name is Jason Wardrop, and make sure you subscribe because I launch a new video every single day, how to generate more leads, make more money, and grow your business, all right? So thanks so much for watching today, guys, and I will see you all tomorrow.